for information on well-being and animal rights, check out my website, hoffenethics.com. The girl. Let's just say she doesn't lose hope easily. All we can do now is pray. Hey guys, Alex the Vegan Gamer. We're playing El Shaddai. Alright, let's move on. So I went and had a look on the internet. Figure out if there was like different ways of defeating the monsters. With you gone, the fallen angels are regaining their power. Or alternate endings, depending on what if I kill the monsters or not. And that was kind of not the case. <laughs> Obviously, you have to kick monsters, but to be able to move on to the next section. Those who oppose them are on the brink of annihilation. I was just wondering because they were talking about Enoch's decision. So the first monsters were just like basic monsters that you could not necessarily kill because they weren't attacking you. So I was like, maybe I need not to kill them. And I didn't. And it really doesn't matter if you do or not because afterwards there's more bosses and monsters and those guys do attack you. And obviously you have to defend yourself and defeat them. Like this guy. Watch your armor, Ross. Whoa, he's totally different than what I fought before. Get out of the way! I just have to jump. Pretty easy. Whoops. Spoke too soon. Why did the person be moving? Is it gross there? So far. Whoops. <laughs> Heavy metal music. Awesome. Every single one of Armas moves as if he's dancing. Even when he walks, he kind of struts. <laughs> Sometimes it works jumping, other times it doesn't. Oh, 
I'm gonna recharge my armor for the other boss. I hope so. Oh, he moves at the same time. me fight the pigs again. What is that, an Indian skull? Why are we seeing an Indian skull? <laughs> Thank you. Lucifer. So I shall go to heaven. Yeah. Uh huh. I was mistaken for you again. <laughs> You'd think devils and gods would have better way of communications than cell phones. She's ready for a fight. I wish she'd explain to us what's going on more in this game. Can I return this way? Can I? Is it gonna stop at some point? He still seems to be getting away from the door. Oh my goodness. I did not know I could escape this. Can I escape it entirely? Is he gonna stop at some point? Ah, who was that guy over there? Is he gonna turn evil because I'm 
heading far away from the door. Whatever, I'll just load my game and start all over and tell you guys what happened. I wish he could run though, it'd be way faster doing this. Nope, you guys, there was an invisible wall, so I just stopped there. <laughs> well, I tried it for like Life five minutes. Shall walk in the darkness. Who are you? I guess I got a new. Ishtar's departed soul shall join the living one and free the imprisoned folk. I got a new partner. New ghost partner following me. The girl obtained light in exchange for our souls. In order to choose her path freely, she overcame fear and doubt. Am I gonna the reach the of her soul brought about a miracle. I'm glad about that. Nana seems very nice. No fallen angel can understand the burden that choice inflicts upon the human heart. Enoch. I will put an end to this false world. I got my jeans again. And my armor. Hooray. But I can't run. Still have to walk. Go into the light, Enoch. Go into the light. <laughs> Who is that, Dark Enoch? Oh, yeah, it's him. Vileness has been purged. But where lies your heart, Enoch? You must overcome one final trial to rid yourself of I know, it's the worst weapon against him. This one's the best. At least he doesn't have any missiles.
chances I have to change my weapon depending on what he does. That yeah, seems to be the right weapon for him. Alright. I'm keeping this weapon no matter what it is. I can defend myself. He is definitely possessed by evil. That's good. That's a perfect weapon when his coins are down. I need it. Veal for the win, you guys. That Nephilim's an adult. With the loss of Sin and you, Ishtar has awakened. It is only a matter of time before they wield power. Enoch, your legs may be frozen, but your soul makes progress. Think back to when you served as a scribe in heaven. Your pure heart has now chosen free will and found the strength to use it. I can run now. Use that heart to save the remaining people on Earth. Until the Council abandons its plan to flood the world. Run towards the light! Yay! Those guys remind me of interview with a vampire. Ten years. Talk about taking your time. Tom Cruise and Brad Pitt. Rise up, Pinoch. I got a trophy. Welcome back, Enoch. Welcome back, Enoch. Good to see the old fire still burning in you. Next up is Arachiel's realm. He'll come at you with all he's got. Not to worry, though. 
He's no match for you. Enoch leaves his body behind in the human world and returns to heaven to purify himself from the vileness. Reflecting on his previous battles, Enoch begins to doubt his mission. But after listening to the angels and observing the world from heaven, his doubts are dispelled and he returns to earth. Without a moment to spare, he rushes to aid Ishtar in her battle against Ezekiel. So guys, don't forget to save the animals, kick some monsters butt, and I will see you in the next video.